Hello everybody, how are you guys doing today? Um, it's been a great day, really nice out. I've been getting a lot of things done. Um, so I, I originally was going to come on here and talk about something else, but instead I, um, I had a miracle happen. So uh, we're going to talk about that. So I have a friend who, if you took the opposite of me, <laughs> that's him, like, uh, he, he is, um, we're di we just came from two totally different worlds, but it is insane how much and how well we work together, like, it's great, and so, um, I call, it's Eli, Elias Romero, and um, I called him today, and I'm like, I got this idea. Like, a, a lot of times, there's people that I try to help, and I I'm new to the like to the gang lifestyle and all of the kind of stuff. Um, also, um, it's it's different being a woman than being a man. Um, I think there's a lot of things that only men can help men with, and. Uh, and so he is my go-to guy. I call him my rock. And uh, I called him today. And we are going to go live. Um, and I'm going to let him talk to you guys. And uh, I'll, let, I'll let you guys, you know, ask him questions and stuff. Um, he's an amazing man. Amazing. Um, he's got 19 years sober. Um if you like when I first met him I was really intimidated by him like like oh you don't mess with this guy you know and uh and we have become just really great friends and um he has it's crazy how two people from such different worlds can come together and help so many people like it and work so well together doing it it's crazy and um, it's awesome. It's beautiful. It's absolutely beautiful. That's God right there. That's God. And um, so this man, through throughout me getting sober, um, I met him about five years ago. Funny thing about him is he used to own a roller skating rink. <laughs> and so I met him about five years ago when I was getting sober. And there were a lot of times that I reached out and he never didn't answer my calls or, you know, even if it was like the middle of the night, he helped get me through it. And, um, and he was there for me a hundred percent. And, um, later on, I had him come talk to my uprise kids about, you know, his life and what it was like, you know, growing up in, you know, in gangs and prison and, um, all of that. And, he he really had a positive effect on these kids like just amazing and on my babies and then um what a lot of people don't know is um a while back you know I call them my kids but they're not mine but one of my kids went missing and this kid is extre <laughs> extremely close to my heart and he was missing for almost a month and I was well, everybody was flipping out. Um, I was like really flipping, really flipping. I was doing everything I could think of. And um, it was through Eli that we found him. And like he helped me and we finally found him and he was safe. And um, and now he's home and he's safe. And um, but that was all Eli. And so. I'm just telling you this because it's just amazing how, you know, how people in our addiction, we all have, we all have different stories and they are all not fun, um, real yucky, you know, but I think we all kind of start as this little person that just wanted love or wanted to be loved and and then how we go from there um, is, you know, that's, that's each our own story. But when we can come back and work together 
for the greater of the world. Um, that right there is just a beautiful, beautiful thing. Um, I guess I'm gonna, I'm gonna say this again, like May 4th, Monday at 1 p.m. We're going live and I'll make sure to put something out there. You don't want to miss this. You don't want to miss this. Um, he is, he's amazing. He is just amazing. And um, the two of us working together is just so great. Like we, we've been working together for a lot of years now and it's just a really great thing. Um, and he can cover a lot of things that I can't and, and I can for him, you know. Um, if he has questions about how to um, help a woman, you know, he'll ask me. Um, so it's the same thing. It's two different worlds, but we both have the same heart. And we both are two major hustlers of hope. <laughs> so um, Monday the 4th, may the 4th be with you, 1 p.m. Mountain Standard Time, going live. The one I will, I did want to quote one thing. All of us are living in our consequences. And our consequences of our addiction, it's, it's the high cost of low living. Think about that. The high cost of low living. We all, we all, we all did it. We all, you know what I mean? It sure is a high cost. So uh, um, just keep your hope. Whether you have one day or 30 years, I'm proud of you. I'm proud of you. And I just, I never want to see anyone go down that path. Nothing good comes from that path. No matter where you come from, how much money you have, what color you are, what race you are, what religion you are. There's two places you end up, prison or dead. They don't judge. Those are the two places that you're going to end up. So remember, take a better path, reach out, and go to the people who've been down that path. Talk to us, you know. We'll help you. We will help you. So I'm going to let you guys go with that. I will see you, Manana. And again, Monday. May 4th, may the 4th be with you, 1 p.m. Mountain Standard Time, Mermaid Amazing and Elias, we're coming at you live, all right, you guys, have a great night, I love you, Mwah.